All right, so today I'm gonna to tell you about the Sirocco 12 volt fans. Um, these things are bloody fantastic, mate. I'll run through the features and how many we've got in our caravan and show you how they work. But um, first, I'll show you the box and this is what you're gonna get and what you're gonna get inside. Now, they're super easy to mount. You can either hard mount them, which I'll show you, or you can use the wiring and get like a cigarette lighter socket plug and you can make it portable. But in the box, you will receive the fan like that, super lightweight, they're fantastic and also a little set of instructions and some wiring and a base plate, all right? So that is how it comes in the kit. Uh, this is what they look like when they're installed in your caravan. So features, let's read them off the box for you and then I'll show you. They have a gimbal design which allows for 360 degree airflow on all three speeds. So let's have a look at that. Sitting there like this, you can actually spin this fan fully right around in any direction. All right, and also the inside spins on a gimbal. So you can change any direction you want depending on where you want the airflow, fantastic. And then like this, you're probably thinking, oh, it's gonna get in your way when you climb into bed. Well, on the side, there's a little pin. All you do is lift that. And you can lock it up out of the way into that position or swing him around. You can lock him all the way up into that position. All right, so you've literally got unlimited uh, directions on where that fan can blow. Now. The three speeds, uh, you've got a button on either side so you can access it from either side. You've got one speed, two speed, and then swing in here because listen how um, quiet they are. Three speeds. So that's the fastest speed. You get really good cooling airflow and look how quiet it is. All right. Also, you've got um, for kids and for nighttime, you've got four different timers. If we swing around here, you can see these blue lights. Uh, you've got three hours, six hours, nine hours, 12 hours. So that way, if you're in camp in a location where it gets cold during the night, you can put these on at bedtime and you won't wake up cold because they'll turn themselves off. I've also heard of other people using them as little night lights for the kids, just putting the blue light on. So that might work in your favor as well. But while we're on the subject of kids, uh, and kids like to put their fingers and get their hair caught and all sorts of things, don't they? Uh, these things have got like a finger safe blade or like a function where it's not gonna keep spinning if anything gets caught in it. So to show you, here's my finger. Look at that, doesn't hurt. It just stops, even on the fastest speed. Might give you a little bit of a touch up, but it just stops. So good for kids, good for their bunk beds. I will show you, um, I'll swing down there now. We, our kids have got a fan in each of their bunk beds at the foot of their bed, which makes it great for sleeping when we're off grid in the caravan without power. And in our van, we have one here above the main bed, which can swivel around and blow fan onto the parents in bed. And there's also one here on the wall, which blows into the dining area. So no matter what sort of situation you got, you got plenty of airflow. Another big feature of these is that they're super low current draw. So we can have all five of these fans on overnight and we know that they're only pulling minimal power off the battery system. You're not gonna wake up with a flat battery and your fridge isn't working. So that's a big plus for us. One more thing I'll tell you about them is that they are 12 and 24 volt compatible. So you can use them on either voltage setups and they come with a two year warranty. So how good is that? Not that we've um, ever had to replace one, to be honest, they work just bloody fantastic. Uh, now I'll show you how to clean them quickly because they do get quite dusty. I've, um, I've actually cleaned this one. If you have a look, it's nice and smooth and non-dusty. There we go. And then have a look at this one over here. It's uh, very dusty. So here, I'll quickly show you how to do that because it um, keeps your van nice and clean. Anyway, uh, all you do is spin the gimbal around. Look how dusty it is on the back. And there's a couple of little clips on the back. You push them in and the, the grill on the front is removable. Once those pins are removed, you just grab the grill on the front and slide him out, like so. There you go. The blade's also removable. You can grab the fan blade in the center and just pull it straight off the hub. That way you can grab a, a clean cloth and give everything a nice wipe before you put it back together. Once you've got all the dust off, or as good as you can, I'm not that great at it, all you do is line the clips up and feed them back in gently and uh, give the grill a bit of a push and it will stay there until the next time they need to be cleaned. So mounting these fans, uh, if you get a caravan built, you can get the caravan manufacturer to put them in. But if you're gonna buy some from Anaconda, you can install them yourself. They are super easy. I'll quickly show you how it's done. I'll pull this one off the wall and give you a bit of a run through. There is just two screws that hold it to a base plate. 
take that one out, remove the fan around the other side, and take the other one out. Once those screws are out, you just lift the main fan and you can pull it away from the base plate. There you go. So this is what comes in your kit. You will have a base plate, some screws and some wiring. That's where you screw the base plate to the wall. You wire up your fan on the bottom of your fan. You have two terminals, a positive and a negative. You connect the supplied wiring to those and then you can either uh, connect it to your wiring your van or like I said, you can use a 12 volt cigarette lighter socket and run it off any sort of power system you want. To put the fan back on the wall or when you're installing it for the first time, all you do is sit it above the base plate, line up the holes and then once they're lined up, you just push down and then the two mounting screws then return back in to the base plate mounts like so. One, turn the fan around and two. Done. I'll quickly show you on the bottom of these fans, there is your two terminals there. So they come with two supplied nuts and washers and they're marked clearly negative and positive. And you just put your red wire on the positive, black wire on the negative, and then power it up to your battery system. So I hope that gives you a bit more info into the product, into the Sirocco fan. They do come in a black and a white as well. So you can choose what color you want. But we have been using these uh, for seven years solid in caravan life. Kids love them, we love them. They're a fantastic product to have in your van. And they make your trip more enjoyable because they actually work really well at keeping you cool on those hot days in the outback, up north when you're camping and that in your caravan. They're a bloody good thing. All right. Thanks guys, I'm sure there'll be lots more info down below for you to check out at Anaconda.